You know, I truly was blessed uh, in my coaching career to work for four great coaches, but I've also been shaped along the way by a lot of great assistant coaches, a lot of great coordinators, uh, more importantly, a lot of great players. I'm not a screamer and a yeller. Uh, you know, I enjoy Flip Flop Friday. I love, you know, kind of taking things for, for what they are. I love kind of taking an approach to the game that I love to make Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday the hardest days of the week because Saturday's got to be the easiest. When Saturday rolls around, I want 60, 60 minutes of, of just, you know, fanatical effort. Uh, I want to make our players be at ease because we all know it's very difficult to, to win a game. What you can't do is lose a game. Uh, you can't make your players do something that causes you to lose a football game. Uh, it's hard enough to win them, so I think that's a very, very important part. I think the, the, the greatest thing that I've been able to, to say on a daily basis is I live every day for what it is. You know, the one element we have on this earth is we all share a thing called time. You know, no matter how much money you have, no matter how much wealth you've occurred in life, you can't buy time, you can't borrow time, you can't recreate time, you can't go back and change time. All you can worry about is what today is. And you know, one of the things that we'll talk about in our program is every day matters. If you let yesterday go, that's your fault. If you take tomorrow as, a, as something that you're not gonna take advantage of, that's your own fault. So I think uh, time is, is what I've learned as a head coach. It's a race, it's a race from now until next year's SEC championship game, and the only person who controls that race is me. As a head coach, you know, I don't wanna be the head coach of mediocrity, I wanna be the head coach of excellence. I think the part that our kids will embrace when we start back here in January is, I'm gonna expect them to have success in every area of their life. You know, to come here to the University of Arkansas and see the people that are first class, uh, they're very, very uh, outgoing about their passion and love for the Hogs. And you know, you don't get that everywhere in the country. It's, it's part of who they are, it's part of our DNA. And I think as coaches, as players, we're gonna really, really try to embrace that. We're gonna wrap our arms around and kiss it every day uh, and, and take with it everything that that means. Um, if, uh, you know, Arkansas is a, a team that, you know, uh, right now might be on the bottom looking up, and a lot of people may not expect great things out of us, but we'll expect it from within. When we're in the red zone, we're going to make sure that we have touchdowns, not field goals. We're going to be clean and efficient and make sure that we get as many points on the board as possible. I think our strength will be up front just in the returning players that we have. Uh, they're going to be very, very sound in their techniques. We're not going to try to slow our players down with verbiage or communication. We're going to let them pin their ears back and run up the field as hard and as fast as they can and create havoc. I think as a head coach, the one thing that I've learned is I get better every day. Um, the part that I've enjoyed as a head coach is, is being around great players. I love being around great coaches. Uh, I hire a head coach on offense, I hire a head coach on defense, I hire a head coach on, uh, in the strength and conditioning department. What I'd love to do is to make all three of those things blend together. I love to, to drive into work every day and I say to myself, what's going to happen today that I have no idea is going to happen? And when those things come up, you need to rely heavily on what you are, you know, what you've been, uh, what have you been able to do in the past, what are you going to be able to do in the future? In the fall, if we get better every day, if we can play at a level that allows us to make improvements on a daily basis so each week we get better, it really doesn't matter what happened yesterday, it's about what's in front of us. If we can say that at the end of the year that we got better every day, we're going to be somewhere nice.